back with another episode of Miner's Greed, otherwise known as the quest for every item in Minecraft. So today, hopefully we're going to get some sort of home base set up. <laughs> home base. Um, so yeah, I actually have thought about it a bit. Um, I mentioned in the previous episode, on the tail end of it, that I was going to build a boat here. Uh, and I will, but first I kind of actually want to build a sort of house here first. So being that I want like this sort of area to be a pier that goes off, I will have to build my house around that. So I'm not sure how. But for one thing, this chest is going to be in the way. Um, I'm going to instead sort of reorganize my items, move all this stuff off, maybe into the water. And then we shall get going. So I will be red right back. Inconspicuous, oh yeah. It's definitely not staying there, but I just need to sort of prepare myself. Right, so let's get out a workbench and furnace and start going. Actually, I think I need to still smelt some previously done iron, so I'll do that. Where can I put these guys? I'll put them like over here, I don't know. I don't want them interfering with our grand master plan or whatever, of which this is clearly not such thing. Damn it, let me put a furnace on. All right. So, how are we going to, do I even need sand on the side? Or should that be like, I know, I can put like sugar cane there. And it can be a sort of side thing. I don't know. I don't know where I'm going to that, but we'll find out. Uh, I do need another reed for that, but whatever, when it grows, we'll take one off and put it there. We need two more actually. Okay, so, let us, we have a lot of jungle wood from last time. Which is precisely what we're going for. I'll take these half slabs as well. Um, so, first of all, we build the boundaries. Right, I need to think where I'm putting this pier. You know, let's make the pier first. I have the slabs, don't I? So we can do that. Now, I don't know if I want it jutting. I don't know if I want it part of here. Like, if I want to get this bit and make it. Yeah, why not? Let's do that. See what I'm going for is this, and I'm going to have this jut out all the way. Uh, maybe I'll just do this beginning bit first. I don't know. I'm so excited. I'm, I haven't built a thing on Minecraft like with that as the sole objective in ages. Uh, I realise I might not be getting many items in this episode, uh, but everyone needs to start somewhere. And as soon as I get a base set up, it'll, everything will be hunky dory. I uh, probably should have put my bed down somewhere. Oh, and here's the music. And I didn't mean to do that. Yay. <laughs> right, so. Yeah. 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 And yeah. Okay. I'm getting a bit of lag. I'm just going to check that out. Oh, it's just lagging for no reason. That's great. I'd rather there was a reason. Then I could fix it. But I guess not. Right, so. I'm going to also want a lot of jungle leaves, but we'll get around to that momentarily. Um, so let's see how this works, I really didn't mean to do that. Yeah, we'll put on the edges first, because of the way you place wood now. So we'll put that like that. Um, this is, should be interesting. I don't know where exactly I'm going with this, but hopefully it falls into place. Oh, no, 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 no. No. Don't do that. No. I don't want to use too much of this on the actual wood. Alright, we'll see how it goes. So. No, that's going to look strange. I'd rather it was all on the bottom, actually. So, never mind what I just did. It looks better like that. This is going to be the base of the house, if you hadn't guessed. Um, and then the door will be here. I think that seems like it will be the only access place. See what I was saying before about it being like the night time or morning song? It's midday. I think using a bed messes it up. Right, so we'll get rid of these. I don't know what I'm going to make the floor out of either. Oh, I should have thought about this more. I did sort of think about it, and we're out of axe. I did splurge most of it, to be honest, last time. On that giant tree. Let's get that iron pickaxe out. Um, and we definitely do not have nearly enough sticks in our lives at the moment. 
axe and my axe. I don't have anything on me. <laughs> this is a problem. I'm trying to like put everything away, but then I need to keep withdrawing things. Let's get the iron out. In fact, speaking of which, hello, cave sound. So yeah, yeah. I guess this counts as getting an item. This episode. I made an iron axe for some reason. I could really have just gone with a stone one, but whatever. Now we have it. Also, with new like, I'm trying to think of what new blocks that will be introduced in the latest snapshot. Anyway, there's like some sort of clay, hardened clay. I think is what it's called. I don't know how that's going to be implemented. Um, see, this is what I want to be up so that you don't have it on the side. So I guess it has to be that here as well. Annoyingly, that's what I meant by that's what I was doing before. Okay, so I basically am now just putting the things back that I did before. <laughs> Stupid. Um, actually, I think it's best if I leave space here. Hmm. Right. Right, I'm actually going to come back once I've decided what the heck I'm doing and finish up with this. Okay, so I kind of have the surrounding base. Oh, hello pig, how did you get there? You're inquiring into my furnace. So, this is a bit of a higgledy-piggledy thing, I realise. Uh, but this is sort of going to be the base area. And then lean out to the pier, so the doors will be here. Uh, now is the question of how I'm going to operate my windows. See, as you may have guessed by now, I kind of like to not mess with as much of the surroundings as possible. Which is why I've laid this out like this. And you should not be doing that. You should be doing that. Yeah. 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 Alright, I don't know what that was. I think I'm just having a weird moment. Just ignore those. They happen occasionally. Right, so... I'm going to want to build some of this up, mainly here, and then have a lot of the rest as windows, I think. So these will be going up. Moving on up. I don't know about this part. This is a very narrow edge, but I'm going to keep it like this and then sort of work around it. What I think is probably going to happen is that I'll cut maybe some of that out and it'll be a window. I don't know. A very small window. And then, of course, as I build upwards in stories, I don't plan on making this building that big, uh, but when I do that, um, I'm allowed more, like, sort of room for movement, which would be nice. I realise just now that I don't have enough room for windows, uh, but I guess it's okay. I definitely still don't have enough wood, do I? Um, so this is a very ominous house right now. Uh, but these are sort of going to be my window areas, and I don't know whether I want to make it out of glass or not. Although, I may as well go and get a load of glass anyway. If only I'd got a lot of sand when I was at that desert, then I wouldn't be in this predicament. Cave, shut up! <laughs> I'm have to put up with that this whole game. Right. I have a solitary torch on me. I should probably get out my torches. <laughs> Come on, grow, goddammit. <laughs> You look out this window, we go see sugarcane. Very strange. Right, torches, okay. So, we'll get sand from somewhere. But again, I don't want to take it out of the surrounding area too much. So, if it is going to be glass, it'd be glass panes. Uh, I'm thinking maybe I don't need glass. I need something, though. Just in case bad guys like try and shoot through it. I'm just going to get glass anyway, because we need some items. This could be like... Oh, that's an idea. For now... This could be like a dock for boats and such. Let's get that workbench. I really should just move my workbench back over here now. <laughs> Let's do that. For now, it just contains the small Minecraft boats. Just to get to shore. I like that. They stole my trailer. I like that. Right, let's plant these here. Um, and I don't. I haven't assigned my rooms to be anything yet, so there's that to consider. Also, I'm using a lot of jungle wood for this. Right, let's make two boats because we can. I have made so many chests already. That was not my intention. 
Boats! There's not even that much water, but it's literally to stop me swimming across every time, and I'm stuck. Oh god! Ah, breaking the laws of physics is good, isn't it? So, I'm trying to go to somewhere. Not too far away, but that hopefully we'll have some sand. Or I could just dig. Let's, I don't know, I'm being really pedantic now. I could get this sand and it'd be no real problem. Let's get this sand. That's right here. Right here. You know what I think this game needs? I think it's time, amongst other things, by the way. I make a lot of suggestions, as do most people, I'm sure. Oh, whoops. No! Not allowed. <laughs> You're not welcome here, dirt. This is a sand party. Right. What I think, then, is it's time for a new biome, I think. Because I think the latest biome we've had is jungle. And that is... We had that a while ago. I think... Did we have that before the full release? I think we may have done. I know we got it during my first hardcore mode. I think that was the period... Yeah, it is. It's very strange. So yeah, I think we're due a new biome. I'm trying to think of what it'd be. I know... Well, I mean, I really don't play that much Feed the Beast, but I'm fairly sure they have several different kinds of biome. We need some sort of lava-based one. Like... With volcanic rock and such things as that. That would be nice. Uh, but again, yeah, I'm trying to think of what else we could actually do. Thinking of different climates. There could be like a desert that's not such a desert. Like, because that's the only real sand sort of area we have. Is just desert. I think there needs to be a lesser desert, if that makes sense. Because those are things, I'm fairly sure. Put this back in the boat chest. Right, and then we'll smelt up this glass. And that'll be another block to add to the repertoire. Uh, but I'll use glass panes. It's so much more f efficient. I don't know why you wouldn't use glass panes. Unless you were going for that specific look. But if you just wanted glass, then just do that, man. It's all good. Depending whether this needs to be here. There are a lot of... Yeah, you know what? A lot of this doesn't even need to be here. Only the things on the outside, so we'll save wood by doing that. So, for example, we could get you back. And we'll spruce this up a bit. Uh, no, it's not spruce wood, is it? That joke is ruined! It makes no sense. Right. But now that looks strange. Um. Oh. Okay, some of this might look odd, so we'll fix that. I can fix that. Obscure reference once again. Right, get rid of that. Okay, now we have more space. It's looking a bit better, I suppose. I can't really do much about that. That's how it's supposed to look. Um, okay, there was one area that looked a bit strange. Now that I'd done that, and it was here. Um... I see, that makes sense. Oh, we've got more reeds. I only just realised that. We have exactly 64 wood as well. I guess we'll do that. I think that makes sense. Alright, I know. It just looked weird. It was the only one that looked that weird, though. Right. Yoink! Shut up, bat. Uh, we do have a pet bat, I suppose. Just chilling around. Right. How much of this glass have we done? I'm trying to think now. I need to make some sort of like window area, but I don't know. Oh, I definitely did not mean to do that. Uh, okay, well, we have glass, yay! And we're about to have glass panes, and someone slammed the door again. They seem to wait until I'm making videos before I do that. God damn it! And I know you can click and drag, I'm really not used to that though. Right, let's see how these glass panes look. I'm not even sure if I want to do this, but it would be a complete waste if I then tear these down, so I guess I'm stuck with them for a brief period. Yeah. I think that's all of them. Yeah, that's alright. Um, and then, of course, we've got to add another layer, but this is where it gets tricky and we have to make our own sort of staircase up. Or I could just try and jump off this chest. Yeah, oh man. It's not double tapping today. Yeah. Okay, there we go. Man, what balance skills I have to stand on a glass pane. Oh, no, never mind. <laughs> oh, again, this is Minecraft. 
Right. So. I think this might be the last of this wood. I was also kind of hoping to you build some of it out of this, the planks. But now I don't know what would fit there. I'm not sure. I'll think about it. But wood in general just looks a lot better. So, one here, here, here. Oh, and of course, over the windows, we do that. Or do I want to make them too high? No, that would make the house too big, so I don't think that would work. Oh, man, this one's a big one. Oh, yeah. I don't know what that was supposed to be. I apologize. Plonk, plonk, plonk. Going through the wood like no one's business. I guess... Now we're inadvertently making the entire house out of this. Yeah, I think the planks are good for the like walkways, but the actual house should be made out of wood. Yeah, this isn't a bad floor, I suppose. Definitely lacking everything else. <laughs> Why is this not a window? This could be a window. Oh, okay. Um, will this work? Or, uh, no. <laughs> this could be a glass block. See, that's where a glass block comes in handy. When the glass panes glitch out on you. There we are. It's kind of like a snug window-ish thing. But now it seems weird that I have that, but glass panes and everything else. No, I'll just... I'll think about it. My OCD nature's playing up. I can't have one that is not a glass pane. Screw it, we don't need windows everywhere, it doesn't matter. And the sun is setting again. Okay, so... Now, I guess we could use um, jungle planks for the floor. That can be what it is. Um, I don't know how long I've spent on this episode. Oh, I definitely need to go to sleep. And we're back. I don't know how much longer. I'm trying to think of how to decorate the floor. I think I'm going to need other types of wood. We'll see how it goes. So let us... Do I want that oak wood? I think spruce would look no, no, spruce would not make any sense, really. I really do not have much oak wood, do I? Let's change that. Let's go out on the quest for more oak wood. Oh, man. Physics breaking boats again. Right. Yeah, it looks okay. Yeah, I need more wood anyway. So, off I go on the quest for more wood. Oh, shit. <laughs> well, there goes one boat. <laughs> but I did inadvertently get some wood out of it, so I guess all's well that ends well. Now, I keep getting confused, like, even though the sun is just rising, it also seems like it's just setting, so that throws my mind off a bit. Oh, man. This could be, like, where I get the wood, because this, for some reason, has a mix of both types of wood. This is oak wood, yeah? Yeah, it is. All right. I guess we're harvesting this tree, and then it sort of cuts back into jungle. This is very strange. <laughs> I'm liking the variety for some reason. Oh, man. You know, sometimes, I don't know if it's just me that gets this. It probably is, but there are occasions in life where life's frame rate seems to speed up. That's the best way I can describe it. It's like if, you know, it's sort of similar to how when your ears sort of they don't pop, but they sort of become clear for no reason. And then you sort of hear all these more things, and it's like, oh man. It's like I my ears just got refreshed or something. And like now I'm hearing everything again. But I get that with, like, I don't know. It seems like in life, this is going to make me sound like I'm on drugs or something. I, I swear I'm not. Not today, anyway. Um, I swear, like, sometimes life's frame rate just speeds up. And you'll just go, whoa, it seems as though you're just, like, moving slower. It probably has something to do with sugar in your body and stuff. I don't know. Maybe. Maybe it's a crash or maybe that's something that happens. I don't know. I really can't describe it. But you do get that. I noticed that if you've been running around a lot and then you listen to music, the music seems slower. This is to music that you've heard often, and like it sounds slower and maybe even pitch slightly, it would be down, wouldn't it? Because of how fast your like heartbeat is going or something. Well, I don't know the science behind it specifically, but it makes it so that you sort of hear it in slower because your body is moving faster than it usually is. 
so it is slower to compensate, which is very strange. Anyway, I don't know what got me off on that tangent, but we're back. We have some wood. Uh, there's a skeleton. It's probably in the cave below. It was a pretty big cave. I'm just hoping it doesn't interfere with life. It, hoping it doesn't interfere with me going to sleep. And then I'll be okay. Then we can move on. Let's get rid of these guys. Okay, there is a skeleton around here. I don't know whether to... I'll just put in a template floor. No, you know what we need first? We need doors. Let's do that. Not that wooden doors helped anyone. <laughs> but there you go. Oh. Damn it. Why aren't doors stackable? <laughs> I'm sure there's a reason, but I don't know what it is. Uh, where the hell is this guy? We haven't had guys that close below us. Okay. We got a door. Every good house has a door. I don't like how there's a skeleton near here. I don't like it. I'm well equipped though, so I'm, that's not what's bothering me. I'm going to have to keep these as wood doors anyway. That's what we need as well. We need different types of door and fence posts. We need different types of those things. Right, what am I doing here? So now let's try and make the floor. But I'm not entirely sure how I'm going to do this. I'm sort of trying to pattern it. I don't know how well this will work though. Um, I don't know. I see. I could checker it, or I could have it so that there's like an outside ring going into an inside ring. You know what? Actually, I think the whole thing will just looks better with this flooring. Even though it will look a bit plain. And also I don't know if I've covered enough wood for such a thing as this. Is this going to break the doors? God damn it. <laughs> Temperamental doors. No one likes you. Yeah, I suppose uh, we could mess around with it. Let's put the doors back. Shut up, skeleton. I know, the skeleton could be like that annoying neighbour everyone has. Damn it, Frank! Or you can get like the opposite situation where you're the like loud people and you have the neighbour that's always like, Oh, be quiet, man. Some of us are trying to sleep or something. I'm thinking of Carl from... Um, what the hell's the programme called? The one of the fast food things. God damn it. I'll flash it up on screen. How the hell can I not remember the name of that program? <laughs> I don't know. I'm having a bit of a brain fart, apparently. Okay, so this looks okay. Aquatine Hunger Force. That's the name. Okay, I got there. I got there. I don't know why I couldn't think of that. It's a very strange program, but... Uh, yeah, actually, come to think of it. Right, we're going to put in some jungle blocks and then see how it goes. Uh, it probably won't go well. So I will report back when I've done. And uh, see, this just looked like someone's like thrown up on these blocks. I don't know. I'm thinking maybe other types of wood will look a bit better. But I don't have those. No, I'm going to change back. Or maybe if it all looks jungle? We'll see. I guess it doesn't hurt to have some of those oak wood planks around anyway. I suppose it also does make sense that this would be jungle because, you know, we're in the jungle. But I like this theme we have going of like biomes clashing, so there's that as well. I kind of like the idea of like suddenly going through it. Like all the, what is it, it would be planes stuff. I think it's mostly planes that we're seeing here. It's a very strange terrain that I've come across and I'm about to run out of wood. Let's correct the situation. Shut up, Frank! That is now your name. You can't escape it. <laughs> right, so actually, I don't want to just end like that. Also, it's definitely... I could make a doormat of some variety. Of course, when I, the new latest shap... Shap shot! <laughs> the latest snapshot is actually the release. We can have carpets. And I want curtains! <laughs> Actually, curtains would not be of much use here. Right. So we come in, and... Yeah, it's okay. It's harmless enough. Needs a few paintings, but we'll be okay. 
Um, but what I was going to do is, oh, we're nearly out of wood. I was going to have maybe a log coming along down the center. And then, I've seen some people do this, and I like the design and I use it loads. In fact, I did it in my second hardcore mode. Keep banging on about hardcore mode. I miss it, apparently. I'm having some sort of withdrawal from my hardcore mode. Right. So what I like to do, it doesn't seem like it'll work as well here. We can try. Where's the workbench? I'm shuffling everything around all over the place. Uh, no, I put my bed down there for a reason. <laughs> right, so I bench down, and we're making a bunch of stairs, I guess. Oh, but no, if I make the stairs, I can't go back. Oh man, decisions. You know, I'll just leave it for now. I've probably spent a while doing this as well, so we'll change this back, and we'll just leave it like this. I did not do that much item gathering this episode, and I apologize, but we need a base of operations. I'm not just operating. This isn't. This is a high quality business we have going here. We're not just operating off the land. We get an actual house. Also, it would be nice if we had a roof. But you know, one thing at a time, guys. One thing at a time. I'm not having a stroke. So, uh, I guess. Thank you guys for watching. And I'll see you in the next episode. Toodles.